Among older adults, keeping their balance, coordination, and quickness in check is a top priority. And for those who currently don't have the best of these attributes, it is likely incredibly difficult to navigate through life. Whether this is playing with your grandchildren, traveling around after retirement, or even just going out to dinner, if your balance, coordination, and quickness is not kept up, these aspects of your life will be much less enjoyable. But at the end of the day, there is actually plenty of great exercises that we can do to improve your balance and quickness in in your body. This will help you to keep your overall quality of life at the highest it could be. Today, we will look at some of my favorite tennis ball exercises that I use with many of the seniors that I work with that can, of course, help you too. So of course the main purpose of this is to improve your balance, but something that often goes overlooked when it comes to older adults is their ability to move quickly. This is exactly why many of these exercises are not only going to challenge your balance, but also a senior's capacity to move fast through space. Seniors who can move more quickly are at an extremely less risk of falling. And older adults who can manage to do all of these tennis ball exercises, especially the last one, may never fall again. For seated tennis ball drops, you will start in a seated position of course. Next, you will extend your arm out far in front of you with the tennis ball in hand. Then you will drop the ball and stand up out of the chair to reach forward and grab the ball after it has bounced once. This challenges not only your leg strength, but your quickness as well. If you joined the video so far, make sure to subscribe to the channel for more videos on improving your balance, regardless of your current ability and how you think, look, and move. For standing ball drops, this exercise involves you standing tall with the tennis ball in hand. After this, you will extend your arm out once again and drop the ball. Just like the last movement, wait until the ball hits the ground before stepping forward quickly to catch the ball. Make sure you alternate which leg is reaching forward to get the best equal work. Side ball drops is a challenging movement. It's similar to the last one though. The only difference is that instead of placing the ball in front of you, you'll place it to the side before dropping. You can make this more challenging by looking straight ahead until you drop the ball. This challenges your vision, which is highly affected in balance as well. Do this drop on both sides for equal work. Those are amazing, but the double ball drop is going to be even better. For this one, it's going to look exactly like the standing ball drop variation. The only difference is that instead of waiting for the ball to hit the ground once before reaching for it to catch it, you will actually wait for a second drop. This increases the difficulty because you will have to reach down, challenging your back, core, and leg muscles. And before we get into those last exercises, I need to remind you of something. Those first three movements are excellent, but it's not everything you can do. In fact, the seniors that I work with who have mastered not just those first few exercises, but the next as well, improve their balance and quickness the most, and honestly, they've never fallen since. Once you've mastered those movements, you can move to the wall. For this, you are simply going to toss a tennis ball against the wall straight ahead of you and catch it. This helps your quickness and coordination tremendously. After that, you can start tossing them to the side to make the difficulty increased as well. Last but not least is the wall catches with a reach. This movement will have you do a similar motion as the wall catches, but instead of having the ball go back towards straight ahead, you will throw the ball down on the wall in front of you, forcing it to react to two bounces and bending over to catch it. This will challenge your entire body strength and coordination. Practice these tennis ball exercises daily, and I promise you, the chances of you falling will be so low, you may never fall again. Tennis balls we recommend will be down in the description. You can check out our fall reduction program as well. And if you don't want to do either of those, just check out the next video from my channel that I'm going to recommend for you right now.